Hey guys, it's Jag. Welcome back to the arcade. Let's get back to just another game, Shantae and the Seven Sirens, where I am not where I said I would be. I was trying to find my way back to the cave, and I realized that there is something in the top of this hole, that, or the top of this room that we really want to get. And I accidentally triggered the Seer Dance, and I think I get a reward for it. So there is a chest there that you can reveal with the Seer Dance, and you can get some good. More importantly, up here, we can use the Quake Dance to get, hopefully, this Heart Squid. Oh yeah, with a little help from the old Newt, we get another Heart Squid. That's enough to make us a new Heart Container, but we're going to continue on. I think I'm going to attack, <clears throat> excuse me, I think I'm going to tackle this in a little bit more of an organized way than I have been up to this point. And we're going to try to clear out as many individual areas as we can. I'm kind of curious if there's anything in here. So a lot of gold nuggets are hidden in chests that the Seer Dance can reveal to you. And we're going to try to get all of those as well. But I am mostly focused on the Heart Squids because they are life. They are love, they are life. And we actually will only have like 16 left to find, I think. So let's see, we want to go to the warp room, which is at the top. Oop. We want to go all the way up here. I want to get rid of you. Kind of want to just push you off over here where I can dash across and not deal with either of you. I'll happily take a little hit for that. And the warp room should again be... Up and to the left. Okay. Right over here? Uh... Yes. Perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and tackle the mossy biome because I think we can actually get quite a bit of that done. Oh, no, don't want to go there. And then we'll see where else we want to go besides that. I think it maybe Island West is a good candidate. Also, maybe the tour area would be good to clear out. But I believe we can get at least two. Two heart squids here, and that will actually clear out all the heart squids in the mossy biome because most of this was uh, blocked off by tortoises, uh, tortoise blocks. So let's see. Yeah, I want to go all the way across to the. No, actually, I want to go up. I want to go up to start. So up we get. All right, we got that one because we came in from the other way, right? I'm just checking here. Yeah, but there's one more that we can get. I don't think we got. And it should be up this and through the sand. Which is probably why we didn't do anything with this. We did not have the drill ability last time we were here, I think. This is starting to look... Like, really unvisited. Let's start with a refresh dance. See what we get out of the tree. Just some magic. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Oop. Uh. There we go. <clears throat> now let's see. I believe this is where we want to be. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at my details here, trying to figure out if this is the right room or not. There it is. Uh, no, that's not a cave. I think it, ooh, crab monster. Crab monster, crab monster. Oh, uh, yes, okay. Actually, I was getting my icons confused. There is something here. It's just not what I was looking for. We used the seer dance though. If we use the seer dance and we're over here. 
There's something there. That's something sparkling. There it goes. We need to dig for it. We got another gold nugget. All right. Now let's go up. We want to go up and to the to the right. Actually, no. We want to go down. I'll figure out my way here. Should be in here. This is the cave we can do. Because now we can smash! Smash, I say! Not Newt Fusion. Yay, that's... Heart Squid number five for what we have currently. <clears throat> that clears out all the Heart Squids out of the mossy biome. Uh, I'm thinking like... We may do another sweep for nuggets later. Like, I really want to focus on heart squids. So where are we going next? And I will do a cut there. I think we're gonna go to... I think we're gonna... Ooh! Snakes, before I get hit. I think we're gonna go to the Island West. I'll see you guys in a few minutes. All right, this room just east of Tree Town has a cave that we weren't able to complete before, but with frog form, we can finally get in here and get an easy heart squid. Yay! And then we can swim back and we're done. I believe that we have done the other heart squids that are in this area. I'm gonna go ahead and head back to the tour area, basically back at uh, Arena Town. I'm going to check those caves on the way, so if we haven't done them, I will let you know, otherwise I'll see you in arena time. Alright, so I'm going to be a little bit sidetracked. Um, we actually got the heart squid that was available for us in the tour area, but then I saw that we never went down this water hole right near where we talked to Uncle Mimic. I'm kind of curious what's down here. Go frog! Another Pac-Man puzzle? Can I get through this one without being hit? Well, that's a good start. And that's a good finish, actually, because I did it. Go me. So what's my reward? Looks like a lot of gems, which is good. I mean, I, I, I like gems. Um, gems. Gem is my reward. Gems are truly outrageous. Not really what I came down here for, but... I figured I would at least get to show you something interesting for all the time it took to come down here to the tour area. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and see you in the next area I want to try. So just to go ahead and completely clear out the sunken ship area as far as heart squids go, I forgot there was a cave here. Let's check this out. Hopefully we can do something about this with Quake Dance? Ah, there we go. And there's seventh heart squid for what we have. Not bad. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do another cut and uh, I will see you guys hopefully in a new area. One moment. Okay, I found the cave with the poison water and honestly, this may be the last heart squid we can actually get for a little while until I get my next ability. So let's go ahead and head in here and I promised to start the episode with this cave, but we're at least going to be able to do it. Just go ahead and refresh and float on over. You don't even need to use the frog ability. You just need to know that the refresh dance cures poison water. Wow. I mean, you can because it's faster. But all you need to do is just float across the top. Hmm. You don't need to use the frog ability at all. So with that done, I think we're going to go up, claim our new heart uh, heart containers, and then we're going to go find Ghost Dog and turn in the bracelets, because I think it's time to go ahead and progress with the story just a little bit. So I'll see you guys in a few more minutes. Alright, we've got two heart holders to claim, so let's go squish some heart squids. You're at my service. Yes, melt them down to make more health for me. Forge him. Smash! Yay, heart holder. Increase by one. Go ahead and melt them down again because I got one more. 
forge. Let's go. Smash! It's the snack that smiles back. All right. So we only have three, well, 12 more heart containers to, or heart squares to find. But like I said, I don't think we're gonna, we're gonna be able to do most of them until I get my next ability. Speaking of which, we should also check in with Sky. What do you want? Here for my advice? Not really. If I were you, I'd tag out each time you rescue a half genie. <sighs> It'd take a lot less work. Aww. You're incorrigible. Suntanned. I wonder if we're gonna see her get sunburned. I do feel like her character art has changed a little bit to update the fact that she is suntanned. I wonder if she gets sunburned. Anyway, let's head back down and talk to Ghost Best Friend. I guess we'll call him Poltergust in honor of Polterpop. Yeah, we'll call him Polterpop in honor of Polterpop. What am I talking about? Poltergust? That's the vacuum cleaner. We don't name him in honor of the vacuum cleaner. Nobody cares about the poltergust. It's all about the polter pup. Polter pup is very important. All right, I brought what you seek. You brought the bracelets. May I sniff them? Yes. They smell fine, but I reek of lies and deception. What? For you see, I am not truly a ghost dog. In life, I was a guardian genie. Oh, But Ghost Dog, I, I like both of you? <gasps> no way! My job was to protect this island. But when the Seven Sirens ca came, I was unable to save my people. I sank the Sirens' vessel, and using my magic, buried it deep within the island itself. Think you gotta trap the Siren for good? I took their power rod and broke it into two parts. I hid the pieces in the mine where only my quake magic could find them. This way the sirens could never again power their vessel. So, the sunken city, all of this, is their ship? I knew it! Called it. Called it! Pick up the phone because I called it. Yes. You have learned the secret of this island. Now I will combine the two bracelets to form the power rod once more. Take it. You got drained, Power Rod. Though I had them trapped, I was not powerful enough to defeat the Sirens. I battled their leader, the Seventh Siren, and lost. All I could do is rob her of her physical form before I fell. For many years, I have re I've remained down below as a ghost. In all that time, I watched helplessly as the Sirens lured my people down into the depths to meet their fate. I want you to put an end to this madness. Take that power rod and reactivate reactivate the siren's vessel. Sail it away. Take it someplace where the sirens won't be able to harm anyone ever again. Only you can do this. Now I will remain a mangy dog. In its current state, the power rod is useless. You must restore power to the rod somehow, and then take it to the control room directly above us. Huh? Restore the rod's power? How do I do that? Perhaps a person with a scientific mind can, li can lend assistance. A scientific mind. Maybe Uncle? Uncle Mimic? Mount Fusion. That's the only person I can think of unless I'm supposed to take it back to uh, the metal fish people. But I thought their scientists, or at least one of their scientists was trapped. I guess let's go check out with Uncle Mimic first. Alright, uh, let's see, Uncle Mimic, maybe Sky knows where he is since I'm now looking for him? Here for my advice, not really. If I were you, half genie, blah blah blah, she's suntanned. Okay, so no help there. Hmm. You're back! With good news, I hope. 
Harmony is safe. That is good news. That only leaves the zombie. Roddy Tops. Okay, uh, well, I don't know who I'm supposed to go talk to, so I'm going to try to think on this between episodes, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for coming out and joining me today. As always, I appreciate it. If you enjoyed what you saw, let me know. Give me your likes, leave me your comments. Remember to subscribe. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.